Hello my friends, this is a General Motors 6.5 liter turbo diesel V8 and in fact this is the engine that we will shortly install into the turquoise dually, the 1994 Chevrolet 3500. I wanted to conduct a size comparison between this diesel V8 and a small block Chevy 350 engine, a gasoline V8. Granted the diesel engine has most of the ancillary still fitted whereas the gasoline engine here is much more bare bones but I think you can see there's a considerable size difference between the two. I was curious about the weight of the diesel engine and I've been searching online to try to find a definitive answer. The figures that I've seen are all over the place and in fact I've seen as low as 650 pounds. Now that is a laughable figure. A Chevy 350 small block weighs between 550 and 575 pounds. Do you really think that this diesel V8 weighs just 100 pounds more? Neither do I. I'm thinking that the long block weighs around 750 to 800 pounds and fully dressed I'm guessing that this engine is around 900 to 950 pounds maybe maybe pushing a thousand pounds it's still less however than the international 7.3 liter V8 diesel that we see in many Ford pickup trucks and the excellent six-cylinder Cummins 5.9 liter B series engine that weighs approximately 1,100 pounds. The 6.5 liter turbo diesel engine was used in General Motors trucks from 1992 to I think 2001 I think it was replaced by the Isuzu Duramax in 2002 correct me if I'm wrong it's not a terrible engine certainly way better than the gasoline derived 350 diesel engine which GM used back in the 80s nevertheless neither is it a great diesel engine there are some obvious features which I dislike first is the fact that it's a V8 and not a straight six so you're losing torque Second, I dislike the fact that like a gasoline engine, it uses a timing chain instead of direct gear drive. If the valve train were stronger, then it would be able to stand up to gear drive. I thought about converting this engine from a timing chain to gear drive but from what I've read online that would be a bad move because the valve train simply wasn't designed for the torque that's transmitted to the camshaft from the crankshaft through direct drive and also that the valve train would have problems coping with the vibrations from the crankshaft All of the other styles of diesel engine 
that we have have direct drive. This is the only diesel engine that we have that has a timing chain. The 1995 Chevrolet 3500 HD Wrecker that we have has the same engine. Thank you so much for watching.